Hello everybody, Jim Duckworth here, and I want to introduce you something brand new for me, and it's the Power Pole XL. I've seen them on TV, I've seen the Redfish guys using them. I just did a Redfish DVD down in Louisiana with my son, and the guy that we were using had one on his boat, and the minute I saw him using it, I realized how good it was going to be for crappie fishing. If you'll notice right here in front of me, I've got a big line of trees standing in the water and this line of trees is about five or six hundred foot long trolling motors spook fish real bad even quiet trolling motors like my Minn Kota so what I do is I can take this power pole I can drop it down into the water and the one I happen to run is the power pole XL it's an eight foot model and so an eight foot of water I can run it into the bottom of the boat if you'll notice I'm sitting dead still the boat's not moving at all and I got about a five or six mile an hour wind and I can fish this cover out as soon as I fish this cover out that I can reach, pick up the power pole with my handy little remote right here, take my trolling motor, move down another 50 foot, drop it back down and repeat the process. And it is the handiest, neatest tool that I have run across in a long time. So let me show you a few little things about it I think that you're going to like. And remember, it's the power pole XL, and you're going to have to have one after you see the way I use one. Okay, guys, here is the Power Pole XL Shallow Water Anchor System. This is it completely raised up right here. Now, with this remote, it'll actually reach about 30 or 40 foot. And here's how easy it is to work. You got up and down, two buttons. Dummy proof, in other words. I hit down, watch. I'm in the bottom. Boat sitting dead still. Boat's not going to go nowhere. I can hit it a little bit more and shove it a little bit harder down into the bottom if I want it to sit extra deep, you know, and extra hard in case the wind's blowing real hard. They say it'll hold a 22-foot boat in 30-mile-an-hour winds, and I believe it because when we filmed the saltwater DVD, it was doing that down there. And then to bring it up, all I have to do is right here, look here, just hit the button, and right up it comes. So, I mean, you know, it's just dummy-proof, and it's just so handy works off 12 volt power took me about two hours to install it just four bolts through the back of the boat and a hydraulic pump on the inside and then two wires over to my 12 volt battery now you can buy it with or without the remote but I highly recommend that you get the remote on it that way you can run it from the front of the boat but you can buy it without the remote and just have a switch on the front console of your boat but for me the only way to go is right here and I'm just going to hit down, let it go down. You see it hitting the mud. Now I'm just sucking it down into the mud a little bit. You can see it's pretty muddy bottom right there. And it's just solid as a rock now. And now I can go to the front of the boat and I'm going to catch me a crappie off one of them trees right there. So hold on just a minute. <laughs> okay, guys, I got a little bite right there. See the bobber going down slow? That's, you can tell a crappie. A crappie always, look, he's, he's, he's just nipping at it. That's all he's doing. When it's cold weather like this, that's what those crappie do, but now I'm going to let him get it underwater about two inches. There he is, right there. There we go. <laughs> this is what you can do with the power pole now. I'm not having to make any noise at all. Ooh, easy, big dog. That's a dandy right there. That's about 12 inches. Power pole XL crappie. You got to love it, don't you? <laughs> Supper tonight. You guys go out and buy you one of these power poles, and you'll be glad you did. And I'm just here to tell you, I'm glad I did. All right, guys, we went out there and we showed you what this power pole would do, but sometimes it's hard to understand what things are doing when they're underwater. So let me show you what this thing does when it's on the trailer in the parking lot right now. Watch this button right here. See that right there? Now, how cool is that? That puts uh, either six or 800 pounds of pressure. I can't remember which it is. But you notice it moved my boat. Watch me pick, up, uh, pick it up. You see that right there? Now watch it hit again. See, it actually moved the actual boat. And, it keep, and that hydraulic pump keeps pumping for just a minute to push it down into the mud so it'll hold you real good. And as you can see, I just got done fishing with it. And look at it. It's spotless clean. So you don't have a whole bunch of mud in your boat. Like when you throw an anchor in a boat to hold your boat in place, and then you got to pull that anchor, you got all that mud you got to bring back in the boat. That is a ticket right there, boys. That's the best thing I ever put on the back end of my boat, I guarantee you. Get you one of these power poles, and you'll notice, here's where it's bolted on right here. Just four little bolts right there. Two little hydraulic lines run in right here. 
and then underneath these doors, now I build my own boat. So that's one of the things about me telling you when something's good because a guy that builds his own boats knows a little bit about boats. My pump and everything's mounted right inside here next to all my batteries and my chargers. That's the ticket. Buy you one of them. Power Pole XL.